The first step in making anything is to cut your pieces to size. So here's my maple, here's my cherry. I'm going to make uh, boards that are 16 inches long. So I measured off 16, put a little mark there, and now make some noise. And line it up. Hold. I want two parts of maple. I'm going to go two and then one with the cherry. So I'm going to get another 16 here. Which actually has three of them are 16 inches long. Interesting. So now my cherry. Um, the reason I decided to go 16 was because of these, this knot, uh, wouldn't be a good piece for cutting board. So that's right in about 16. So that was going to go 18, but we'll stick with 16. three pieces to make a cutting board. Now my next step is to rip them. Time to rip on my table saw. Uh, I'm going to do the maple and the cherry. One of the maples and the cherry the same width. And then I'll change up the width for the other maple. Nothing in particular. We'll do about three quarters. For the first set. Eh. Now I need to plane these to get them a nice smooth surface for gluing and make sure a nice even surface. The hard part about this is having to stop it and adjust it every time you bring it down just a little bit. Adjustment goes by 164 for each quarter turn, so I just did 132nd. And that still didn't get anything. And that's the hardest part is trying to see where you're really at. Because I could measure this with calipers, but trying to translate that to a dial here is tough.
I've already done all the other ones. Um, so this one had a little bit of trouble with it. These two did, so I just redid those again. But that gives us a nice surface to glue to. Now that I've glued it all together, I need to plane it as a whole because it's going to have some ups and down mo movement, kind of when you just kind of squeeze it together. As much as you try and press it together top and bottom, it's still not going to come out perfectly. And there's also some glue stuff on there that's easier to get off just by uh, planing it. And again, the hardest part is finding where exactly it's at and taking it down little by little. My shop back. <laughs> As you can hear, that really got something that time. Um, so this side's really nice now. That will get sanded later also. Uh, now I have to flip it over, lower it just a little bit, and do this side. I'm not worried about the thickness of my board. I can keep planing and planing and planing. Because I already I started it off thick, and that's part of the idea. So you're gonna you start it a little bit thicker than you really want it. And I'm only taking off a 64th or a 32nd at a time. So it's not a lot when you consider, you know, three quarters. So that is uh, both sides planed. So then comes sanding, design, and then oiling. 